From snapping turtles that can bite your bloody, to prehistoric monsters the size of a car, here are 12 of the most dangerous turtles ever. 12. Turtle on the Rampage So, let's start off with a story that illustrates how severe a turtle bite can be. The village of Irsi in Bavaria made some news when a snapping turtle bit an 8-year-old boy in the foot while he was swimming in a lake. The bite was strong enough to sever the boy's Achilles tendon and put him in a plaster cast for nearly two months. As you will note in some upcoming segments, snapping turtles can be extremely aggressive, and they are known to eat almost anything they can find. Zoologists think that this creature was either an alligator snapping turtle or a common snapping turtle, neither of which is native to Germany. So that would likely make the common or gator snapper an exotic pet that was released into the wild. News of the turtle's attack spurred the mayor to have the lake drained and the native fish moved to another lake nearby. A reward of more than $1,300 US was offered to anyone who caught that vicious beast. 11. Red-Eared Sliders Did you know that this is the most popular pet turtle in the United States, and in much of the world as well? Part of that popularity stems from the fact that the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles belong to this species, although the real-life versions are not so well known for their martial arts skills. Now, on average, they measure about 8 inches long and can live for up to 30 years. They're known as sliders because of their ability to slide off of rocks and into the water quickly. All in all, they are very cute critters, so what could possibly make them dangerous? Well, in some parts of the world, such as Australia, these little guys have become known as an invasive species. In Oz, they are viewed as a serious threat to native turtle species there. The sliders can grow large, up to 12 inches, and the size and aggression helps them outcompete the native reptile species for food and habitat, among other resources. They've also been known to introduce diseases into the areas they invite. 10. Stupendomies Fossils of this huge prehistoric freshwater turtle have been located in South America, dating back some 6 million years. Based on a nearly complete fossil, the creature is estimated to have had a carapace length of around 11 feet, with an estimated weight of some 4,400 pounds. That would make it the largest freshwater turtle ever, as well as the largest of the side-neck turtles. Now, side-neck turtles, that refers to those critters that have to fold the necks to withdraw the heads into the shells. Experts think this creature attained its massive size as a way to protect itself from the huge crocodiles and other predators found in its habitat. Because it stayed weighted down in the water, it likely posed more of a danger to the aquatic plants it fed upon, 9. Toxic Turtles Did you know that there is a way that turtles can prove dangerous to humans, and it does not involve their strong jaws shearing off our fingers or otherwise chomping down on us? There have been several cases of disease in the U.S. being carried by the reptiles, and by pet turtles in particular. Salmonella poisoning has been reported in at least 11 states, which occurred after handling pet turtles purchased at pet stores or flea markets. Most of the victims were children, in whom salmonella can cause severe illness. Symptoms can include abdominal cramps and fever, and last for up to seven days. Turtles can carry the bacteria on the shell surface and on the outer skin, and that's a major reason why the sale of baby turtles less than four inches long has been banned in the U.S. since 1975. 8. Archelon The largest living turtle in the world today is the leatherback sea turtle. It can measure more than 7 feet long and weigh around 1,500 pounds. But its ancestor, Archelon, easily dwarfed those impressive dimensions. That prehistoric beast had an estimated length of some 13 feet and weighed upwards of 5,000 pounds, making it roughly the size of a Volkswagen Beetle. It was the largest genus of sea turtles ever documented and lived during the late Cretaceous period around 80 million years ago. Experts say that Archelon would have had an extremely powerful bite and likely fed on mollusks like squid and crunched down on crustaceans as well. Now what made it potentially dangerous was its unusually wide flippers and soft pliable shell which could have made it as fast and nimble as a mosasaur. 7. Mata Mata Turtle Now they not only look dangerous, the name sounds dangerous too. Mata Mata is Spanish for 
Kill Kill. But despite the appearance that makes it look like some sort of a swamp monster, this is a fairly laid-back beast. The native to the Amazon and Orinoco basins of South America, where they can grow to around two feet in length. Now, interesting to note that their serpentine neck is longer than the creature's vertebrae, and it can actually serve as a snorkel while the reptile stays submerged in a stream. It captures prey by creating a low-pressure vacuum with the mouths wide open, which allows them to essentially vacuum the victims into the mouth. By snapping its jaws shut, the water is expelled and the prey is swallowed whole. They rely on this suction feeding due to the way the mouth is constructed. 6. Carbonomies With the shell measuring nearly 6 feet wide, this creature would have been one of the largest turtles ever. Its fossils have been recovered in Colombia, where it lived some 60 million years ago during the mid to late Paleocene. Although smaller than Archelon and Stupendomies, this had to be one tough critter, given that it coexisted with the enormous snake Titanoboa as well as some large crocodiles. Experts think the creature had tremendously powerful jaws that could have clamped down on almost any type of prey, and yeah, that would have included crocs as well. The animal could have survived by taking out its competitors in the area. And by the way, speaking of tough, did you know that turtles were among the few animals that survived the KT extinction event some 66 million years ago? Tough indeed. 5. African Helmeted Turtle also known as the Marsh Terrapin, this reptile lives in stagnant and fresh waters in sub-Saharan Africa. Their carapace can range in size from about 8 to 12 inches, and they do appear innocuous enough. But they're also called the Crocodile Turtle for the feeding behavior they can exhibit. This is the only turtle species that is known to attack in groups. When larger prey, including water birds, snakes, or other species of turtles, are within range, these omnivorous critters will launch an assault on that prey, capture it and drown it. To the human eye, it can appear like a swarm of crocodiles attacking. 4. Loggerhead Turtles after the leatherback sea turtle, this is the second largest extant turtle in the world. They generally weigh up to around 440 pounds with a length of more than 3 feet, but the greatest weight documented was more than 1,200 pounds. That serves to make them the largest hard-shelled turtle in the world as well. And they are widely distributed throughout the world's seas. They're noted for the powerful jaws and for having an aggressive temperament, at least where the females are concerned. Female-to-female -female aggression is fairly unusual with marine vertebrates, but it seems to be commonplace with loggerheads. Conflicts occur over feeding grounds, with the confrontations escalating until the turtles start snapping the huge jaws at one another. The standoff will often end with one combatant chasing off the other. 3. Leatherback Sea Turtle this creature is the largest of all extant turtles, and at more than 1,500 pounds and measuring over 7 feet long, it is also the world's fourth heaviest modern reptile as well. Now, instead of a hard shell, they have a series of bony plates that is covered by leathery, oily skin. Along with its hydrodynamic, tear-shaped body, this creature is noted for its mouth. They have no teeth, so instead of chewing the food, this turtle uses its upper lip, and down its throat are a series of backwards-facing spines that not only help it swallow its food, but also serves as a means of preventing the prey from escaping. And it's kind of scary looking as well. They're also pretty adventurous creatures. They're found in waters from Alaska all the way south to New Zealand. 2. Common Snapping Turtle This big turtle can be found from Canada to Florida. So, the freshwater critter seems to favor its share of adventure. It's notorious for its aggressive disposition when taken out of the water. Its beak-like jaws are powerful, and its head and neck are exceptionally mobile. Adults can weigh up to 35 pounds, with a rugged carapace that measures more than 18 inches. Usually favoring ponds or streams, they typically don't have many predators, but they actively hunt down prey, including fish, frogs, and small mammals. Since they're at the top of the food chain in their environment, the common snapper is not too easily perturbed. When encountering a human in the water, the turtles will often swim quietly away. But if they're caught, they can become extremely aggressive as noted and can deliver a bite strong enough to amputate your finger. So if you see them in the wild, it would be best to respect the snapper's space. 1. Alligator Snapping Turtle if you want more proof that turtles can be dangerous, just look at this prehistoric-looking swamp monster. The alligator snapping turtle is recognized as one of the world's heaviest freshwater turtles. Its name is pretty much a given thanks to its spring-like neck, immensely powerful jaws, and the ridges on its shell that are reminiscent of an alligator. 
and a lot of people think its shell gives the animal the appearance of a dinosaur. Now, in fact, it's their unique shell that makes the alligator snapping turtle easily distinguished versus the common snapping turtle. The two are not closely related. Now, these snapping turtles are bigger, typically weighing upwards of 200 pounds with a carapace that can measure more than 30 inches. The carnivorous reptiles have a unique appendage on the tongue that resembles a worm and is used as a way to lure prey. They also have a strong bite capable of snapping off a human finger, which makes them certainly a potential danger.